What's good, YouTube, man? It's your boy, D. Miller. Look, we back with another video. And as y'all can tell from the title, man, we got the Phoenix Mercury versus the Minnesota Lynx, y'all. Game one of the WNBA playoffs. And look, y'all, we got a team who is, to me, I mean, I've been seeing a lot of people overwhelmingly. They're the favorites, bro. The Minnesota Lynx, overwhelming favorites. Everybody's saying the Lynx is going to sweep. Everybody's saying the Lynx this, the Lynx that, Lynx this, Lynx that. And I ain't going to lie, I kind of joined in. I ain't going to count. I feel like. I'm biased. I will always be biased. So I'm going to say the Liberty, but I ain't going to cap. They beat us two times to one. So if if we're going by that, they're the better team. So, hey, this might be the best team in the W. Let's see how they look tonight. DT. This might be your last homecoming. I mean, well, last, I said homecoming, your last playoff series. Win a game, and maybe you get to send it, you send it off at home, and maybe even upset the best team in the league. You feel me? If they all they got to do is win one game in Minnesota and then they, they go back to Phoenix and, and get a chance to maybe, you know what I'm saying, maybe get a last little, last little championship under your belt, DT, maybe. But hey, let's see what we got. Offense, they score, they space it, they lead the league in assists, they lead the league at three-point banks. Phoenix got 6-9, Brittany Griner on the interior. She anchored let's see what we got. around the rim for them. We are underway. BG, you got to hoop, man. And I want to see Kyle hoop too, yo. There we go, BG. There we go. Yeah, BG, you got to eat this series. You got to eat. The bucket, Kyle, that's tough. Copper getting downhill for two. The Phoenix can score in their quick hitters before Minnesota gets loaded up. That's going to be an advantage to them on the offensive end. Long two, Courtney Dang. Williams. That's Courtney Williams' wheelhouse. That's what that's what she does. You have to keep your dribble alive when you probe baseline and you get that switch with Griner. Mm. Collier, the step through and the bucket. That's tough. For Collier, who finished second in the MVP voting, as we mentioned. Nine six links. Cloud getting a step on Williams. She hey, I ain't gonna lie. She couldn't guard her, boy. Natasha Cloud getting down with hell. Hey, Kai, get downhill. Yeah, get downhill. They don't got no rim protection. Ain't gonna lie. Minnesota busting their ass, though. One more. Sophie. Bow. They got some toughness about them now. They are mentally tough and they are competitive tough. Outside McBride. Quick trigger. Bottoms. See how they back off. Well, I told you about Minnesota, man. Three cloud way off the mark and up ahead to McBride. McBride got the lay one plus the five. Yeah, Minnesota. Yeah, they living up to their name. Tarasi turns inside, puts it up, and throw. First field goal for Diana Tarasi. Zandelasini outside to Heideman. Gets in the lane, kick out, call your another three, and it's good. Talking about how much it was going to be better for It's not much to say, bro. Like, Minnesota just, they dominating like they've been dominating the last whole season. I mean, they're playing their game. Hot man. And it's crazy because I've been saying, I literally, I was the biggest proponent, bro. Before All-Star break, I said, Hot man, why are you playing so scary? Why do you get the ball? You dribbling to look in the pass. Go get a bucket. He's going to get a bucket now. I mean, it, it, everything... Everything is happening the way everything is happening the way it should, bro. Misha Hans Allen was a beautiful pickup. Like that was a great pickup. Misha Hans Allen fits perfectly in this offense. I mean, it's just like I mean, let's see, bro. Dang. Anything can happen in the game of basketball, though. That's one thing. All they gotta do is just go to sleep. Minnesota's gotta go to sleep for a little bit. And Phoenix just gotta hit some shots. Links never panic when the shot clock winds down. Tarasi, quick trigger. Money. Gonna need a lot of those. The operative word right there. <laughs> Here we go. Gonna need a lot of those. Here we go. We're gonna need a lot of those. The other way and it in. Here we go. One of the fastest in the W, taking it to the rim. Taking them deeper into the shot clock the last couple of possessions. Long two, Williams missed everything. Carlton chases it down. And the fadeaway. With one second that was low key cold. You got Cloud. Cloud. Tremendous first half. The pull up is good. Another three. Natasha Cloud, bro. Natasha Cloud. They're not going away. She transformed her game a little bit because she wasn't. 
Can't lie. Damn, he got 25. I barely. I feel like I don't see. I ain't see 25. It's a good shot. I don't feel like I seen Fee drop 25. They cut out a lot of that. Mm, good deal. Open court steal, Cunningham, the easy lay in. And I mean, 11 point game. Point game. Hey, 11 point game, and it's a lot of game left. 10 point game, a lot of game left. I ain't gonna lie. It's a chance they could come back. Phoenix, they just gotta play D. Not like that. McBuckets. KFC. Knockdown. You've been turned around. Look at they bench. I love that. I love that energy. Oh, yeah, Sophie. Damn, 16 free throws for the Lynx to two to four free throws for Phoenix. Tarasi for three. Money. 18 points. Minnesota could have executed the two for one. Good D. Nearly turned it over. Good D. Collier comes out of there with it. Five on the shot clock. That's cash. The physicality has allowed Phoenix to creep back into this one. Game clock winding down. Cloud for three. Cash. Bro, Natasha Cloud is hooping. Now run that one back, bro. Run that one back because she was. Dang. Stepped into it. Bro, Natasha Cloud. Bro, she, bro, she won it, bro. Hey, man, y'all got a hoop for my dog, Natasha Cloud. Natasha Cloud, y'all got a hoop for her, bro. She's hoop. She got 26, 6, and 6. Come on, man. Y'all got to help her out a little bit. Come on, Sophie. Come on, Sophie. You can't. It's Fido. That's number two in the MVP, though. You can't really do nothing about that. Come on, Kai. Somebody. Come on, Kai. Somebody. BG. Somebody. DT. Somebody help Natasha Cloud out, bro. Please. Four point game. <laughs> there she is. Come on, Cloud. DT. Come on. Come on, Diana. I told you, Diana. Get back home. Get back home is any man's game. Any woman's game. Knockdown. Come on. Just get back home. It's any person's game. Anybody game. Come on. There we go, y'all. One stop. Watch Carlton. Just watch Bridget Carlton from 30 feet, bro. She ready to hit some. Come on. Oh, this game done got good all of a sudden. Boy, the game done got good all of a sudden. Bro, Phoenix got the lead. Watch, watch Fee. Watch Fee. Watch Fee. That is her shot. Cordy Williams hoop it. Ah, uh, yeah, they dissecting their defense now. Now it's just now it's just a matter of everything. The gears, come on. Screw the gears together. Come on, Cloud. They can't guard you, Cloud. Give Cloud the ball and get out the way. I ain't gonna lie. Now is Natasha Cloud time. She can win you the game for two minutes. Come on. Play D. Just play D. Play D. Just play D. Cloud got 30. Just play D, y'all. Watch feed. Give me the cloud. The cloud the ball. Bridget Carlton. That's cash. I ain't gonna lie. Bridget Carlton get plus 20 to her three ball when the game is close, bro. When it's a close game, a clutch three, bro, she get like plus 30 to her three ball because, bro. On the shot clock, Carlton watched by Cunningham. Three ball. Cash. Oh, oh, oh. She hit the game winner against Connecticut. 
38 on the game clock. Copper. Blocked by Smith again. I would have gave Cloud the ball. 33 points for Natasha Cloud. Put in the cap on an outstanding night. Links get it in. Clock expires. Minnesota. I ain't gonna lie, Phoenix. Respectfully, y'all blew y'all one chance to win a game. Y'all actually came back. Y'all was down by 20 something. It was down by like 20 something, bro. They had a chance to win the game, and I don't know exactly play by play what happened, which I kind of wanted to watch the full game, which I told y'all. I told y'all in one of the last videos, if y'all didn't hear it, I'm going to watch the full games from now on, though, for the, for the playoffs. I just wanted to see how good the WNBA highlights was going to be, but nah, we're going to go back to the full games. Um, They're going to be longer videos, but we're going to go back to those because, yeah, I want to see the whole game, but I mean, from what I was able to tell, though, Connecticut, y'all had... I'm in Connecticut. Phoenix had a real good chance to win that game. I don't know what I ain't gonna lie, I don't know where BG was at that whole night. It felt like Cloud, Kai, and DT was the only one scoring. BG didn't really do nothing. Yeah, she had 10 points. She had 10 points, four for six, three for ten. I mean, yeah, she didn't really do much. Um Kai with 30, not Kai, um Cloud with 33 and 10. DT with 21 and 2. Kai with 16. And Cunningham with eight, two for three. She did her thing in the minute she had. Um, yeah, DT got to, I mean, BG got to do better than, than three out of 10, though. But for the Lynx, we got Carlton with 12. Landon Smith with seven. E with 38. Bro, it didn't even feel like she had 38. Shout out to Fee. Damn. 38, four and six. McBride with 20. And Courtney Williams with nine, eight, and six, man. Four steals. Three three blocks for Atlanta Smith. Ten points off the bench for Hans Allen. Five rebounds. And look, man. Hey, man, the Lynx, I think y'all got, I still stand on my sweep. I think the Mercury blew the one chance that he had to win this series. <laughs> they blew their one chance. So, yeah, man, this series about to be over. But, uh. That's all for this video, y'all. If y'all did enjoy, make sure y'all leave a like on it. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Turn on post notifications. And I'm going to holler at y'all in the next video, man.